Halo teman-teman, selamat malam balik lagi dengan gue di KD di HV Playground Apa kabar kalian semua? Gue harap kalian semua baik-baik aja uh, uh, Bukan konten yang bagus, bukan yang ditunggu juga Mungkin uh, hanya beberapa orang yang nungguin uploadan gue uh, Mohon maaf banget baru bisa upload lagi setelah mungkin sebulan ya uh, Karena ada sedikit uh, halangan, bukan sedikit sih banyak halangan makanya baru bisa upload sebulan Uh, terima kasih buat teman-teman yang tetap subscribe gue yang nggak unsubscribe yang tetap setia nungguin uh, konten gue walaupun nggak bagus-bagus banget tapi gue harap kalian suka semua nah buat yang belum tahu channel gue atau yang kebetulan ngeklik channel gue boleh dibantu subscribe dan di like videonya biar gue lebih rajin upload mungkin ya lebih fokus karena uh, akhir-akhir ini lagi sibuk banget sama kehidupan sehari-hari mau pekerjaan jadi belum bisa fokusin untuk uh, buat video lagi jadi mohon maaf Nah, di sini gue bakal lanjutin kisah si Ma Marian ya, Marian di, di Medium. Kita masuk ke bagian ketiga. Uh, kalau kalian mau lihat recap lebih jelasnya, kalian lihat di link dan deskripsi karena gue cantumkan itu pasal dan part 2, jadi kalian bisa uh, tahu jalan cerita dari awal. Yang sekarang gue udah masuk ke part ketiga atau bagian ketiga, jadi di part kedua ini, kan sebelumnya ketiga ya kedua, si Marian ini akhirnya sudah ketemu sama iblisnya. Iblis yang ngelasain tempat resort ini, resort Iwa ya. Dan... Dia belum tahu, jadi semakin masuk malah semakin bingung. Sebenarnya mau dibawa kemana Marian ini? Uh, apa yang mau dia dapatkan di resort Nyawa ini? Karena mempertaruhkan nyawanya ya, menghadapi bis yang belum pernah dia temuin selama hidupnya. Nah di part 3 ini menurut gue lebih keren lagi sih, karena lebih banyak misteri dan lebih horor lagi. Karena emang game ini genrenya horor ya teman-teman, sebenarnya maininnya sih agak daktik duk dia bikin hati jantung ya cenah-cenut lah ya. Tapi Emang salah satu yang menarik itu ya horor, komedi ya, dan mungkin action di bagi di urutan ketiga ya. Oke, cukup itu aja bahasa basinya. Kita akan lanjut uh, the medium kita ke bagian ketiga, teman-teman. Selamat menyaksikan the medium. Let's go. I woke up with icy water in my veins. I wanted nothing but to get out of there. To just get up and run until my legs give out, until my lungs collapse. But I knew I couldn't. It wouldn't have solved anything. And besides, sadness needed my help. Is someone there? Merry and happy. You're okay. Sadness? Is that you? Are you okay? What was that thing? Hello? Richard. Richard? No, Sadness. The man I'm looking for is named Thomas. Who's Richard? He's on the day room. Day room? Are you trying to show me the way? All right. 
What now? First Thomas, then Richard. Before I knew it, I was looking for a bunch of strangers. At least sadness was still with me, in a way. Is that? Oh God, it's everywhere. How many people died here? Let me be frank. This case is problematic. My superiors want it to go away. I want it to go away. You can see how your statement complicates that? Comrade? I... Yes, I understand. Some things don't just go away. They stick. They echo. Cover your nose. Try not to look at him. The sooner we're done, the sooner we can get out of this place. Ah, uh, Definitely didn't need to feel that. Locked. Hey, Marianne. You look like shit. Are those bolt cutters? Might be useful. If only I could reach them. Here. 
anyone? wouldn't do that. He's nice. Ugh, she's talking to herself again. What a freak. Hey, don't talk about her like that. Show me something? What the hell? Snowdrop, huh? Why does that sound familiar? Oh. Closer to the mirror, I felt a slight tug in my pocket. I could tell there was more to that figurine than just carved wood. I can feel it calling out to me. It was the first time that it ever happened. I touched the mirror and crossed over to the other side. Uh, what? What the hell is this place? What's happening? No! No, please, Mommy! Oh, God. What happened to you? Wait. I know you. You were that boy. Bernard, was it? He was trapped there, just like I was. I knew his name, but somehow that wasn't enough to send him away. It was like a part of him was missing.
All these people, they weren't just killed. Their spirits were ripped apart, broken beyond repair. Maybe I can find the one Bernard's missing. I need to look around. That's where those bolt cutters are. So close, and yet so in a different reality. The spirit will. I could use some of that energy. That cat figurine was the key. I can't pass through without it. This was yours, wasn't it, Bernard? It's about time you got it back. For you to find peace. Bernard. Thank you. Huh. It kind of looks like the one I used to get through the mirror. Feels like it, too. There was no escaping it. Great. Another mirror. New details have emerged. The situation may be more complicated than we expected. No time to explain. You'll get the full report once I get back. Just leave it to me, comrade. Very meticulous of you. Comrade? Locked. here. At least, not in this world. There we go.
hands in me. I'm getting close. That woman was here. Oh. She was a ballerina? Nice card. Was Vivienne one of your stars? Okay, last one. I can barely feel my wrist. I don't care. I just want to go to bed. I need to be alone. This room has Guy written all over it. In big sloppy letters. Vivienne? Just Vivienne? No. Probably just a stage name. The artist formerly known as Vivienne. There. That's her room. Someone couldn't even let her have her privacy. Okay. Let's find out who you really were, Vivian. Huh. The page was torn out. I can't make out the numbers. I guess one of these names belongs to your true self. But which one is it? I still don't know her real name. Just words. Sounds without meaning. Partial numbers. A bunch of numbers, some would say. But I sensed there was a lot more to them. Hello? Yes, this is... Vivian. Room 347. I want to make a complaint. There was a man here. Yes, from the hotel staff. Frankly, I think I smelled vodka on his breath. He... What? That was the chief of staff? Uh, you know what? Never mind. Thank you. Well, it's a stressful job, I guess. Hello? Oh, hey. Are they asleep? It's fine. I know you're busy. I'm busy too. Yeah, it's tomorrow. The big day. Yep. Thanks. I'll see you home. Kiss them for me, okay? Not exactly a hotbed of passion. Oh my god, Ellie! I thought you were... No, no, I'm... I'm really happy to hear from you. Why didn't you call sooner? You did? But... Eugene, that slippery son of a bitch. Ellie. She was very special to her. You don't need to be a medium to see it. So... If you were talking to Ellie, that means... Tori. It's you. The real you. That's your name. It made sense, really. A name is more than what everyone calls you. It's what you feel yourself to be.